final day of our high country ride and our resident superhero is lurking in the background. <laughs> and we may need him too. While we don't get to do any single track, we do finally ride some slightly technical sections. Woohoo! We can't complain about the accommodation, a good sleep in comfortable heated rooms, and we are set to climb and descend all day. It's been quite a dry winter, but a bit of recent rain provides some fun in the creek crossings. Most of the riders on this trip had families, and we got chatting about partners and kids. Without exception, they were family men. Dedicated, wanting the best for their kids, putting the hard yards in. But then we got talking about the need to occasionally escape and recharge the batteries. And this might be retreating to a man cave. You know, tinkering with model airplanes, restoring old cars, maybe even stamp collecting. And of course, some of us opt for something far more expensive and likely to kill us. Dirt bikes. Yes, it probably looks like a stupid choice to many. But I reckon a regular shot of adventure is badly needed. Especially when home loans, a soul-crushing job and the demands of family life can slowly squeeze the life out of us. Whatever could I know some of our partners roll their eyes as we head out each weekend to hurt ourselves and label it all as boys and their toys. But I firmly believe we need regular adventures to unleash the inner kid or we'll just slowly die on the inside. Given we are riding on the roof of Australia, it's surprising there haven't been that many scenic views. But on the final leg home, we get some great scenery. It's been a good shot of adventure with all the boys and their toys. Here's to the need for regular adventures to unleash the inner child. Amen.